Hey guys, I want to do a real quick uh, walk around video. I'm going to be selling this boat in the spring. It's uh, December 2015. Had a pretty mild fall, so I was able to get a few last fishing trips in, but uh, she's heading up to be winterized now. It's a 1999 Javelin 18MX Venom with a Johnson 115. Got a brand new aftermarket lower unit, stainless steel prop. Um, Boat runs great. You can see uh, got a Lowrance HTS 7 Gen 2 touch unit up there with a side imaging transducer and the regular 2D transducer. Coming up front, uh, you know, carpet. This uh, middle part here, here is an insert. You can see it's got some, that was after the previous owner added it. It's got a little chipping on the carpet, but uh, otherwise, for its age, the carpet's in, in really pretty good shape. A little bit of discoloring, um, I think probably a good bath. Uh, somebody would go through and wash the carpet, would take it a long way. Um, as I said, HDS 7 Touch Gen 2. Moving up front, nice little front deck. Uh, got a live well up on the front. Got a cooler here, storage, storage up front there. Uh, this boat will actually accommodate an 8-foot rod, uh, rod lockers on the far side. On the front, we've got a Hummingbird 787C2 color GPS unit on a ram mount. Got a Johnson 55-pound thrust, 24-12 volt. I'm running it on 12 right now, moves this boat around fine. Um, little bow mount trolling motor. Boat's actually in uh, quite good shape for its age. A little water line there. I do need to give it a bath before I get it winterized. But uh, for the sake of this video, I just wanted to get something real quick. Trailer is in very good shape. You can see some minor rusting on some of the brackets and hardware, but uh, the whole thing's very sound. Um, a quick little paint job, probably fix that right up. But the rest of it is in real good shape. That's actually a, a leaf, not rust. Um, Trailer here, bunk trailer. Go around, take a quick look at the other side, and try to wrap this video up. I'm doing this video because I intend to upgrade boats in the winter time, and uh, like to have people have an idea what the boat looks like. Um, you know, it is an older boat. It does have some wear and tear. That's just a scratch. Uh, nothing structural there. Um, you can see just a little scratch. It's not a crack. Um, same type of thing up here. Otherwise, the, the boat's actually in real good shape. The gel coat's nice and bright. Another, another scratch here. Um, Got to see if I can just get, get an idea there, the nail on it. But it's a blue flake uh, with silver trim and, and uh, or silver stripe and gold trim. Another look at the trailer. Tires are actually in reasonably good shape, but I will include two brand new ones that I bought and just didn't have mounted yet. Comes with a spare, a brand new spare, never been used. Take a closer look at the trolling motor. Transducer, you can see it's, you know, it's seen some use, but uh, again, the boat's a 99, so um, really think it makes somebody a nice little boat. Boat runs great, runs about 46 GPS with just me. Um, I would say a tournament load. Live wells full and everything is going to be about 41 or 42. I'm a pretty big guy, 6'2", 285. So a lighter load will get a few more miles an hour out of it. But uh, you'll notice it's set up like a bass boat, but it's actually a walleye boat. It's got a much deeper V. Boat's uh, just under 18 feet, like 17, 8. And uh, really handles, I live up here on Lake Champlain, it handles the big water pretty well. I mean, it's not a 21 footer, but um, really does a nice job. So I've been very pleased with the boat, but I'm just upgrading. I'm a tournament bass fisherman and looking to get a bigger boat. So anyway, that's it. 1999 Javelin 18 MX Venom. Pedestal butt seat in the front, of course, and uh, the fishing seat in the rear. Does come with a brand new, never used fishing seat, a Javelin branded fishing seat. I got it in the plastic. I just uh, never needed it. Um, inside this compartment here, I do have some stills of it. 
I've got a, uh, a three bank Minn Kota charger, brand new. Um, you can see the charging cord there. I do need to give the boat a, another vacuum as well. I vacuumed it real quick. Uh, of course, we're at the end of fall here. You can see the leaves in my backyard. Been blowing around pretty good. Um, didn't get a perfect vacuum, but again, that's it. Oh, one quick thing. Um, is a little bit of damage here. The previous owner, this is just purely cosmetic. Previous owner had it in his backyard and a branch fell on the motor cowling and uh, cracked it. Um, you can see here, I'll push on it. It doesn't give or anything. It's just uh, purely cosmetic, but it is uh, something I want you to be aware of. Uh, same thing here. And as I said, it's a brand new three year warranty, uh, transferable warranty on that blower unit. Um, stainless steel prop. It is not perfect by any stretch of the imagination, but it certainly works. You know, it could be reworked. But um, that's it. Lights work. A couple of ratchet straps on the back there. And uh, this here is just flaking black paint. It doesn't even really flake off. It's just, again, through age. And this boat being set up with a little bracket here. So you could put a little kicker motor on there if you wanted to. Electric or otherwise. But same thing on the other side. But um, the other live well, I didn't note this. The other live well is, is back here on the this side, passenger side. And uh, battery compartment, oil reservoir on this side. Again, that's, uh, that's it. Thanks.